All right, welcome to Minecraft Maker. This is Theron, and uh, today I'm going to show you the finished chicken processing unit, version three. So what we need is we need some eggs. Um, I've got a few eggs here. Let's uh, let's see how many are we going to use. I don't need all of these. Why am I carrying that? Okay, so let's. Uh, Yeah, let's go ahead and use all but say, oh, well, let's use that. <laughs> okay, here we go. Make sure there are no beasties laying about. Okay. So there's the building there. It's pretty boring looking. It's a cube. Uh, but, you know, it's not there to be looked at. It's an industrial uh, rendering plant. I've got some dirt scaffolding that's still on there, which I will remove. Um... Uh, but here it is. Again, the dirt will all come off. Uh, so I've got, let's go take a look up at the top. That's what the scaffolding is still up for. You can hear the water. So inside there, we have uh, water. We have a upper reservoir area where the chickens can uh, float and swim. We have a dispenser that will carry up eggs, up a little egg elevator, shoot them out, break them on this block, and hatch chickens in here. Once the chickens are grown, they will start dropping eggs. The eggs go down into a hopper and they will end up in this chest here. Nothing at the moment. And the chickens will end up in this little area here. I should glass in this too. I don't have glass with me. Um, and where they can be crushed. So if we shut down the water flow in the upper reservoir, the chickens will all flood into here. I can crush them. They will end up in here as raw chicken and uh, feathers along with the eggs. The eggs then cycle out of the <clears throat> out of the uh, chest, up the egg ele elevator, and back up in, into the top area. So we can load it up in here. So what I want to do is right now, we make sure that the upper reservoir is filled, which it is, we saw that. The chicken crusher is off. We want, oh, so you can see the water up through there now. The hopper disable. So we are going to fill up our chest here and the hopper will not take the eggs out of the chest yet. Okay, um, and when I turn off the hopper disable, you see they are starting to flow out of the chest into the hopper and into the, uh, through the hopper and into the bottom dropper. And when those fill up, it'll stop flowing, but we don't really want to see that happen. We want to turn on the egg elevator in the meantime. And you can hear the uh, clicking it's the egg elevator going and doing its thing and we want to go up top and watch you can hear the dispenser working and we already have chickens and again I probably could remove that block the stone block the egg breaker um, it's not really in the way it's just sticking out there so eventually all these eggs will stop in which case we want to turn off the egg elevator and um, probably disable the egg hopper and we will have some number of chickens up in the upper reservoir here uh, and then if I'm not happy with the number that we have in here after the first round we can take some of the eggs after they become adults and lay eggs. We can take some of the eggs and uh, and run them up into here and turn them into more chickens. Um, don't want to do too many because we have too many chickens being rendered right around here. We may lag out the uh, the game a bit, even when I'm not seeing them. I they're being tracked if I'm too close. 
the sun's going down. I didn't plan the timing on this very well. And I didn't light this up here at all. So I'm going to do that. Don't want anything spawning up here. Ah, looks like we ran out of eggs. Or sounds like we ran out of eggs. Oh, it's a pretty good number of chickens. All right. So, I have to be a little careful about this, but we are going to turn off the egg elevator. The egg -ovator. We should name it the egg -ovator. And I'm going to just turn on the hopper disable. So it'll take a little while, but eventually the chickens will start dropping eggs, uh, start laying eggs, and they'll end up in the chest here. And then I will have a ready supply of eggs. Okay. Um, well, that's it. I'm going to tear down the uh, the scaffolding tomorrow. Don't have a need to go back up there probably, and if I do, I can always just build a dirt pillar. Okay. All right, well, thank you very much. That's the completed chicken processor unit 3000. All right, okay, so here we are. Um, I cleaned up the, uh, the scaffolding on the side of both chicken units, and uh, here we are. The chicken processor unit 3000, and the, uh, the other one, the, my, my chicken, my KFC. Wow, it's been busy. Okay, let me go clean them up here and see what we got. 64, 63. So the feathers are ahead by uh, 20, uh, by 30. Okay, so here we are. We don't have anything in here yet because the chickens are all still young. But as they grow up, they will start dropping eggs and it will start filling up this chest. And all I have to do is come out and collect them periodically. And if I want to, uh, if I want to get a whole mess of raw chicken for some reason, I don't see a reason why I would need to, but I can uh, come here, uh, make sure the chicken crusher is open, is off, um, drain the, uh, the upper reservoir, click, wait for all the chickens to drain down into, into, into the little hole, crusher hole here, and then uh, make sure that I disable the uh, the hopper and the egg elevator crush all the chickens um, they'll drop a bunch of raw chicken and feathers into the uh, the the chest here and when it's all done I open that back up fill up the upper reservoir again pull out the chicken and the feathers enable the uh, the ho the hopper <clears throat> and turn on the egg elevator and repopulate the top um, do that periodically if I want and uh, I don't know and there might be something I can do decoration wise with this building to make it a little less uh, of an eyesore but uh, right now it's uh, it is what it is it's a completely functional chicken processing plant uh, right next to a completely automated uh, chicken cooking plant oh they're busy all right so there we go thank you for watching um, if you like the video, go ahead and click the like button and uh, subscribe to the channel if you want to be notified when I release new videos. And I have some additional plants. I'm going to do an upgrade on the the garden to automatically be able to harvest the, the melons and the pumpkins in addition to all the other crops. And uh, I've got some other things in the works. So, uh, so keep checking back. And uh, I will, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time. All right, bye.